what is up guys profit here this is gonna be a super short video super short it may even like be short enough for a short but look guys this is something that's been it's, it's been a long time coming i've made a couple of posts about it and you know i guess i was kind of trying to stave off the inevitable um uh, i'll just i'll just go get straight to it guys this is my phone i've shown it on stream before this is my phone um the text line that we've all enjoyed not just you guys but i've enjoyed interacting with you the text line that you know the number has changed once but it comes to my phone no matter how much i tell people listen you're not reaching a call center there's no one pretending to be me like miss Cle no you're texting me and i thought it was novel and a lot of you thought it was novel as well having that level of interaction that level of, um, you know, just being able to reach somebody. You watch the video and now you can interact with me like in real time. But unfortunately, I think it has gotten to a point just for me where having the text line up um, is more hindrance than a benefit. And I'm always willing to give some give some pointers about some workings you're doing. I've, and I've always said that, like, that's what the text line is for. If you have a question about a working you're engaged in, you want some pointers, fine. You just want to say, hey, no problem. I had no problem with that. But there's always those who think that this is not my phone, that it's um, a, a, a line. So it goes off at three, four o'clock in the morning. Um, no matter how many times I post I know some people don't see the community posts. Um, no matter how many times I post that, hey guys, uh, after a certain time, don't message me or that it is text only. How many times have you guys heard me say that? The text line is text only. People will blow it up, call back to back to back. I set up an automatic response like, hey, text the text line, don't call it. People will call it again, back to back to back. And like I said, it's gotten to a point where it's more of a hindrance. And I know I've spoken about this before and people have said, well, probably why don't you just turn your phone off or put it on do not disturb? Yeah, no, I I, I love my family and I want to be available for them if they need me 24 seven. So I'm not going to turn my phone off. And, you know, y'all know I'm out here in in the woods, in the swamp. Shoot. So this is like my lifeline where I if I need to go and get out to my people i need to be able to go out i need to they need to be able to get in contact with me so turning my phone off is not and has never been an option so i was hoping that by appealing to people i say hey this is what i need from you guys to keep this up and running that would be you know respected it hasn't been and guess what guys 99 percent of you are fine and you know and i started to say this for some of you this won't apply um so go ahead but the issue is, I know that there is going to be a certain segment that they're going to feel that way and it doesn't apply to them. You know, <laughs> they're going to be like, oh, I know they don't apply to me. When in actuality, if you were to ask me, I go, yes, that applies to you, especially. And I and I used to hate it when the teacher would say, um, well, sometimes the good got to get punished with the bad. I used to hate that because I, 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 I don't say I always behave, but I most of the time behave. I'm like, why do I have to get punished? Why, why do I not get wrecked? What they call it? recess? Why well, I, don't, I don't get recess? Why well, I don't get the pizza party? I've been doing my part. Well, now as I get older, I see it from the teacher's standpoint. You can't. It's hard to go through and pinpoint. You gotta just make blanket changes. So with that being said, guys, the text lines we know it is is gone. It is gone. I'll keep the number up because WhatsApp. I can put WhatsApp on Do Not Disturb. So the text line. Are you texting me straight? No, you can go through WhatsApp. And get in touch with me there okay and through email so that's the only options right now and if i see whatsapp becoming much of a, bit a hindrance it'll be email only and i i never want it to be like a business you know i always wanted to be just me but it's hard to do work when you always got to pick this thing up or it's hard to sleep and i guess what did y'all know i have two youngers in the house when this thing is buzzing on the table and i just got one of them to sleep and here y'all go oh no Oh, no. So, you know, if it turns some people off, I apologize. You know, that's not my intent. It's just to set up some boundaries, you know. Because, to be honest, it had gotten to the point where there weren't a whole bunch of 
Hey, prophet, um, I'm working on this. Can you help me? That, that, you know, I think having a text line encouraged a level of intimacy that I may not have felt because I don't know you. You know, I know I know a lot of you, but I don't know all of you. We're over 20,000 now. And I would love to know all of you on that level, but I don't. But some people were like, prophet, let me tell you about my day. And I'm like, tell me about your name. <laughs> And it'd be message after message and nothing about hoodoo at all. And if that helped them, then great. I just can't afford to help everybody like that. So rather than um, hiring a, um, you know, somebody to respond, which to me would be unauthentic, you know, I just sort it through email. And that way, if you get an email response, it's still me. I just don't. And then, oh, and then the people with the attitudes, because I didn't pick up when they called my text line or I didn't respond fast enough. Then it's just miles and miles of messages. So we're going to go to email based and WhatsApp based system for right now. All right. And if I see, you know, things kind of smoothing out, then we'll go back. OK. And hopefully y'all still here rocking with me. But I do appreciate you. Oh, and if you made it to the end of this video, guess what? Sugar Mama, Sugar Daddy Kits are back on the site now. Go get them. Um, I have a new oil called Spirit Oil. You guys are going to love it. Go check it out on the site. And I have Compelling Incense that is on the site now. Y'all go check them out, and um, I'm sure you're going to love them. But with that being said, I do appreciate you guys. Profit out.